Hey everybody, it's day four of our prayer and fasting here at Keysgate Church up on top of the hill in Hamlet, North Carolina. We are going into the chapter four of John and we'd like to encourage you guys to read this chapter today. Even if you don't come, read this chapter today and let it speak to you as you read it. I want to let you know today I'm in a different setting because we're on our way to the top of the hill because at Kingsgate today we're real excited. We're opening up our Children of Hope Center and we're going to have a ribbon cutting at, at one o'clock, excuse me. And so we would just like to invite you if you want to come out, come and be a part of this. We're, we're really, really excited about what God is doing and what we're trying to make happen to bless and to help other people. But to get back to the scripture today that we are reading, it's talking about the Samaritan woman. And if you will do some studying and you find out that Jesus, being who he was, was not even having any dealings with this lady because she was a, Mar a Samaritan. But you know, this is the thing that blesses me the most is it don't matter who you are, he will go beyond the religious law to get to where you are. He knew everything about this woman, but yet he still made himself available to her. Jesus knows everything about you. He knows where you are. He knows your failures. He knows your faults. And so today I want to encourage you as you go in and read this scripture, let it speak to your heart and know that God has great plans for your life. Let him bring the word of prophecy to you. Let him prophesy to you through the word of God and let it speak to you as you move forward in your life and allow him to be all that he needs to be for you. Love you today. God bless you. Have a great day. And don't forget, we love you.